This is a pack of the most handy and useful motion presets. It works with Animation Composer, a brand new and free plugin for Adobe After Effects. Let's look at what you can do with this. As first I select a layer. Then I select a preset and apply it to the beginning of the layer. Then I apply another preset to the end of the layer. I can remove the first one and apply another one and change the duration just like that. So easy and so fast. Now let's look at the work for Lilo. Here we have a little donut stand consisting of few layers. As first I will just move the layers in time so I don't have to do it later and this will make it a bit easier. Okay, this is pretty great. And now let's add some presets. Mm, no, 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 this, this looks good. I think I will apply it and also to the, the other layer, this one. And let's check how it looks. Okay, I like that. And now the other layers, I will apply one, the other one as well. Uh, not bad, right? Hmm, now something with scale. You can see how easy it is to find what I'm looking for. Hmm, this one, this, this looks pretty good. And we'll see how it looks. Not bad, I think I like it. And I will just adjust the duration by dragging the markers. And that's it! Done in one minute! Not bad, right? Now let's animate it out. I'll move the work area and select all layers and trim it. And I'll, uh, let's apply some nice effect on it. This one looks great and I will just apply it to all the layers. <laughs> and to the giant donut I want it to go from the top for a change. And let's see how it looks. I will turn on the blur and I don't like it so I will remove the preset and set it to go from the button and then I will apply the same preset and, and move the markers in time to randomize the motion and also the out points of the layers. Here we go. It looks lovely. Lovely. All together in two minutes. <laughs> like a boss. Okie dokie, and what else? Well, we can change and modify anything. You can control the angle of the preset or position, X position, Y position of one preset, another preset. You can basically change everything. Every practical value, what you would think about changing, basically you should be able to do it. So now you can see that it looks different. Pretty funky. Let's look at another use case example. This is a simple chart. It's already animated and it consists of few layers as you can see and it looks pretty cool. And what I can do, I can change the shapes. I can modify it and afterwards it obviously still works. So this is pretty cool. Another example, a text. You can use all the presets for anything and also for text. So you can get really good results in really short time. And it's pretty impressive. And as you look at it, the layers is the same way, the same workflow. Select the layer and apply a preset. And here is the same composition. I just edit the camera, animated it with few simple keyframes, made all the layers 3D with a simple click and this is what we get. So you can see, you can use it even for 3D animation. Let's look at other use case examples. So you can use it for pretty much anything. You get a ton of animations, you can combine all of them, you can control everything, you have full control of in and out animations, and everything works with or without your keyframes. If you are a template author, you can use this to create project file templates. Be sure to check how it works. So, this tool cannot be more awesome. You just gotta get it! <laughs>